Welcome to my quick and easy guide on the 2022 Easter event. You technically don't need any items in order to complete this event, but I would recommend a few stamina potions or even a few regular energy potions. To kick things off, go ahead and talk to the Easter Bunny located just west of the Alcarid Furnace Room. And after spamming through some options, select option 1. Sounds good to me to start the 2022 Easter event. After finishing the dialogue with the Easter Bunny, go ahead just south to Karim, the kebab seller shop owner. Select option 1, talk about the Easter event. After finishing your dialogue with Karim, go ahead and make your way south. All the way to the Shanty Pass, and we're going to be talking to Shanty. Once you've made it all the way south, find Shanty and talk to him. Select option one, talk about the Easter event. After spamming through the options with Shanty, go ahead and make your way north all the way to the market section and talk to Ali Morrisane. Just a few steps north of the cactus area, you'll find Ali Morrisane. Go ahead and talk to him about the Easter event. And after spamming through the options, he'll give you a task. So now we need to make our way southwest of the Alcarid Bank and find his hidden associate. Just south of the bank, there are some boxes. Go ahead and talk to the suspicious crate. And after spamming through your text with the suspicious crate, make your way north back to Karim the kebab seller to get a kebab. Select option 1, talk about the Easter event. Ask for a special kebab with the hot sauce. And once you get the special super hot kebab in your inventory, go ahead and make your way back down to the suspicious box. Talk to the suspicious crate once more. And after spamming through the options, once you get yourself the secret report in your inventory, go ahead and make your way back north to Ali Morrisane. Once you make it back to Ali with the secret report, talk to him about the Easter event. And after finishing your dialogue with Ali, go ahead and make your way just west. Once you've made it back to the Easter Bunny, go ahead and tell him everything Ali told you. And then once you have the big bucket from the Easter Bunny in your inventory, go ahead and make your way just north. And just south of Ali Morrisane, there is a camel by the name of Eli. Go ahead and use your big bucket on Eli the camel. And once you get your big bucket of camel milk, go ahead and make your way back to the Easter Bunny. You hand over the big bucket of camel milk to the Easter Bunny. And a short cutscene will occur where you visit some wizards in the Ferox Enclave. Once the cutscene finishes, you get thrown just a little bit north by the cow pen. All we have to do is run straight south from where you get teleported and talk to the Easter Bunny again. Once you make it back south, talk to the Easter Bunny. And after spamming through some options, go ahead and make your way just east and talk to Ellis the Tanner. Option 1, talk about the Easter event. And after spamming through the options with Ellis, go ahead and make your way just west. And now we're going to search through the pile of junk just behind the furnace building. And once you have all four of the items you need, you'll actually get a little pop-up saying you found some useful items in the pile of junk. Once you get all four items, we need to make our way back to Ali Morrisane over here by the stalls. Because now we need to clean out this dirty vat. Go ahead and talk to Ali about the Easter event. And Ali will hand you over a magical cleansing potion. Once you get the potion, go ahead and use it on the dirty vat. And it will be magically cleaned. Now once you have all four items plus the cleaned vat, go ahead and make your way just south over here to Zeke, the owner of the scimitar shop. Talk to him, select option one, talk about the Easter event, and he'll hand you a set of blunt scimitars. Now once you have all five of these items in your inventory, go ahead and make your way back to the Easter bunny. 
And after a quick conversation with the Easter Bunny, go ahead and create the ice cream maker yourself. Just use any of the items on each other and they'll magically combine into your churning machine. Once you have the churning machine, go ahead and talk to the Easter Bunny once more. And another short cutscene of you going to the Ferox Enclave will occur. And as the cutscene concludes, you'll find yourself in the exact same north location by the cow pen. All we have to do is make our way south once more. With now we have the frozen churning machine. Go ahead and talk to the Easter Bunny. And once the Easter Bunny hands you over the big bucket of camel milk, let's go ahead and make your way a few steps just west right here by the dirty ground. Use the frozen churning machine on the dirty ground spot. And then make sure you right click the big bucket of camel milk instead of drinking it, even though I don't know if it'll allow you to. Use it on the frozen churning machine. And then once the milk is inside, go ahead and operate it. The Easter Bunny will quickly stop you to add some chocolate chips, but then you'll need to operate it once more once he's finished adding them. After spamming through a couple options about making your ice cream, go ahead and talk to the Easter Bunny again. Tell him you've made the ice cream. And after spamming through some more text, he'll tell you you need something to carry the eggs in. Go ahead and make your way back down south to the Suspicious Crate. Talk to the Suspicious Crate again. And after holding down the spacebar again, you'll be handed over a cooler, and once you have this, we can make our way back to the Easter Bunny. Tell him you've got the ice cooler. And once he places the two eggs in your cooler, we need to make our way south to the Shanty Pass. Once you've made your way all the way into the Shanty Pass, go ahead and click on the cooler to check it. And then select option 1 to take them out and start the test. And after a short conversation with Shanty, your actual egg will melt. And now you just need to wait a little bit longer. You'll see some options in your chat as you're waiting. Giving you an indication on how long you actually have to wait. And once you're ready to go, you'll actually get a pop-up saying that should be long enough. And once you have that message, that's long enough, I should go and let the Easter Bunny know. Go ahead and make your way back north. Talk to the Easter Bunny to show him your findings. And after holding down the space bar for another 30 seconds, you have now completed the 2022 Easter event and you're gifted two hat items. The first one is an Easter hat, which appears to be like a straw hat with some flowers. And then the second one is actually a crate ring, but when you wear it, you get smashed down into a crate. But that's everything for this video. If you guys did enjoy and found it helpful, consider dropping a like. It massively helps it out. And if you're around here often and you're not already, hit that subscribe button down below. We're on the path to 3,000 subscribers, so anything is appreciated. But I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll catch you guys in the next video.